You know what? You know what? Screw this. I don't want to bother with engine. I'm going straight to Cortex. I'm finishing this right now and... I'm finishing this right now. The joke's on you. I've got the double jump. I said I've got the double jump. I've got the double jump. Go to hell. This level is called the Sphinxinator. So I'm assuming a guy looking like Arnold Schwarzenegger wrapped in bandages is gonna be like a mini boss. No, of course not. That would. I'm dead. What the? I ta. Oh, come on. Don't mind me, I'm just rummaging through ancient Egypt. Just destroying these ancient Egyptian wooden crates. I'm just destroying a priceless tomb. I'm just getting crushed by a priceless tomb. Oh, this must be the Sphinxinator was talking about. Wow, I'm... Did he just hug me to death? That's not such a bad way to die. That's a none of so that must have been the Sphinxinator this level is named after. I have to say, that's incredibly disappointing. I used whoa. Ah! Oh, the true Alec is now online. I don't care. Stop killing me! Okay, now you see this guy, he's killed me at least four times now. I don't know why, I just am not attacking at the right point. Not this time. This time, I will succeed. I will win. And now his second form is all going Dragon Ball Z on us, multiple forms. And he's gone. That wasn't as Dragon Ball Z-ish as I was expecting. Ah, you think you're being clever, Ancient Egypt? Well, here's what I think about you being clever. You're too clever for me, Ancient Egypt. How many times am I going to do this? This is my life now. This is all there is. I had a girlfriend once. Now all I have is Sphinxinator. That's all there is. Hey Phil, I wonder who keeps leaving these big crates of... Please tell me I've got a checkpoint. Honestly, I thought they would have better security for these ancient tombs. I didn't realize they were allowed to roam free. Or that they could roam free at all, being ancient tombs! You know, Phil, I'm starting to wonder who exactly keeps leaving all these buckets of grease around. I mean, I don't seem to have any points for ah! Oh, I'm gonna be sick. Oh, thank God, monkeys in pots. I need something to lighten the mood. Yeah, nothing like a little animal cruelty to make me feel better. Okay, Phil, I really hope this is the last bucket of grease because I'm actually getting tired of pulling this wrench. I mean, what's the point? Bandicoot jumps over pillars. I drop more pillars. And though, I got him. Hey. Open the door! It's the end of the level! Oh my god! There is human peace! Human peace? Wait, what the hell? I'm just happy it's over. I love Crash Bandicoot! Yeah, this is so much better than a stupid Egyptian stage. Take that, Cortex! And that too, Dingo Dial! Tiny Tiger! And Brio, you're, you're not even in this game, but I'm killing you anyway. Boom! Wait a minute, hold on a second. This isn't... This isn't Crash Bandicoot at all. This is Spyro! Now, this is more like it. Back into the action. Flying high. In... Which war is this? Which war is this? Where are we? What time period is this? I'm gonna shoot this is World War II. And Zeppelin's in World War II, right? But anyway, here I am destroying planes, uh... Wow, these guys kind of suck, don't they? Whee! Oh, Blimpy. Hey there, Blimpy boy! Ah. 
You know, see, this is fun. You see, that that was easy. I didn't need to like, try that 17 times. I didn't get killed by mummies. Why can't we just spend more time in the year flying around carefree? I was over too quickly. I want to do it again. Yeah, now just let Crash do all the hard work. You missed do a really hard level, and uh, okay, if you want to go again, i be my guest. Dead men tell no tales. Yeah, unless they're zombies, and they're talkative. Hey, that, that, that's been a thing before, right? Talkative zombies. Excuse me. Oh, I want, I want this. I don't, I'm not going to try and get every crate. I'm not trying to get gems, but I wanted that one. That one specifically. Sir, you wouldn't happen to be related to a lineage of knights or anything, would you? Yeesh. Ah. Nothing like a dip in the briny sea with my jet ski. Oh, hello. Like I told you. Bandicoot speech sharks every time. What's around this guy? Ah! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh. I'm just realizing those bombs are huge. I've never noticed how big the bombs are. I just run through. Wow, you don't need to go with these at all. I'm just sidestepping everything. I make my own rules. I'm Coco Bandicoot. No, no, no. Oh, that wasn't meant to happen. Huh? Oh, hello. Whoa! Hi. Uh, engine? Engine. You, you got something. You, you got a. F you have an active missile in your head! You have an active missile in your head! I don't think he heard me. Welcome to the world of tomorrow! What does this new wondrous land have to give us? More crates! Yeah, of course there's more crates. I mean, we had crates everywhere else in every other time period. I don't see why not. Okay, I know we're in the future, but can someone just tell me what the hell this is? Is that Cambot from Mystery Science Theater? I just cancelled Mystery Science Theater, everybody. Direct your hate mail to this somewhere else. I don't care. But look. Boing. That wasn't very good armor. He just destroyed him my Wumpa Fruit! What did my Wumpa Fruit do to you? So, the far-flung future offers us Cambot from Mystery Science Theater and uh, more crates. I'm sorry, I'm just not terribly impressed at the moment. You know, it just occurred to me. If this is indeed a uh, game about time travel, does that mean I can go back mm. about three or four years and delete those Let's Plays mm. I did of Apescape 3 that I didn't finish? Because I, I don't think anyone deserves to see them. They, no one's done anything that bad. The spikes weren't even out yet! Your impatience is your undoing, young Bandicoot. You see, it is the journey, mm. not the destination, that you should concern yourself with. Were you a little less worried about getting to the next level to battle the Cortex, perhaps you would have been successful by now in combating him. Or maybe you should just jump on his head. See, this is what I'm talking about, you're too impatient. There are people who speedrun this game, I'm sure, and they are... They are laughing at me. They are laughing and they are angry and they are not watching. I have been to the future, it is frustrating and I hate it. Tomb Waiter. Oh no. Oh no. We're back in ancient Egypt. Oh good. I don't know if there's a god. I don't know if there is any deity watching over me right now. But if there is, I'm fairly certain I'm fairly certain they don't like me. So it was at this point that I actually ran out of space to record and my commentary was cut off. Which is okay because all you're missing is me devolving into a screaming, crying wreck. This is actually the best thing that could have possibly happened at this point. 
I believe this was the part where I declared my complete and utter hatred of ancient Egypt and screamed a lot. Looking back, I realised that Egypt is not my enemy. My real enemy is people driving hot rods. If you drive a hot rod, I will personally find and kill you and all your loved ones. Coco, why won't you love me? Am I not good enough? Why? Because I'm like 14, you're at least 26, I'm a mutant bandicoot, and you're a human, and you've got an active missile jammed in your head! Yeah! Just stop friendzoning me! We are not friends, you psycho! And this, my friends, is why you always bring a spare giant robot to your boss battles. Which is exactly what Engine has done. Engine is smart. Is he giving her gold gems? Is he actually trying to ask her out on a date? Good god. I'm going to pretend for a minute that Engine is my video editing program. Oh. You, you don't want to play ABC HD files without crashing, do you? Do you? Well, this is what I think about that, you piece of shit! And it was at this time that Dr. Engine was sucked into the vacuum of space and felt his brains begin to freeze, his eyeballs explode out of their sockets, and his lungs shrivel from lack of oxygen. Truly, the forces of good have triumphed this day.